Okay, so it's just a quick video to show the installation of a oil catch can on my E60. This has an N47 engine, so it's a two litre diesel. Um, and what I've replaced is the old breather hose here, which comes from the, uh, the cylinder head cover down to the, um, the breather. Bad lighting, bad lighting times. Uh, down to the breather pipe just there. Um, so what I've done is uh, it's a, um, uh, an old breather pipe which I've cut off here. Uh, I've inserted the silicone hose into it. It fits quite nicely. I put the, the measurements and so on on the uh, on the comments. And then that goes um, up to the Provent 200, the man Provent 200, which is kind of the gold standard for oil catch cans, as I understand. This will come kind of used here, and then coming out. Uh, going back into this underhead is, is this uh, larger, larger tube here, and this goes into this underhead cover under here. That's it. That's it. As you can see, it's already a little bit of a tight fit. Um, so the one thing I'm really not happy about is the mounting of the, the actual filter itself. So I'm going to look to improve that. At the moment it's just held on by a couple of um, cable ties, and honestly, that that is going to rattle around. It's not a good location but it's the best I can come up with for now. Now underneath at the bottom of the Provence I'm not sure if you can quite see it but you can see the, the exit tube down there down the bottom try and focus on it. Uh, and that just comes out just by the uh, driver's side wheel arch and um, try and get some light in here. And hopefully you can see there is the drain tube so in that um, every 10,000 miles or so I'll just get under with a an oil drip pan empty that out and uh, that will be that. So, any suggestions on uh, how to improve the mounting would be appreciated. Um, but that's uh, the first time I've seen any video uh, on YouTube of an old catch can for an E60. So, um, thought I'd make my own. Hope that helps someone. Cheers.